But on Mars, there are no borders. Only six human beings representing everyone. By the time we get back, the ISDA will have the operation cards translated and uploaded to us. I'll tell Glenn he's gonna have to change the mission patch. We are gonna need a new flag. Squeeze on this gently. Thanks. Atlantis Kibiok, approaching the Chinese drill site. Copy that. I guess this is the way in. Copy that. For my birthday, my parents gave me a microscope, monocular, only 600 power. But when my father put a drop of clear water on the slide and I looked at it, it was full of living things. I couldn't get over it. You mean there's life everywhere, I asked? He said yes. Then I pointed up to the sky. Even there? Guess what he said? No idea. Exactly. As my father said, the universe is so vast, yet nobody knew if life existed anywhere but on Earth. I knew someday I'd have to go see for myself. I bet you still have that microscope. Of course. And I'll tell you something else. It was made in China. It's working. I really must be out there with them. You need to get in better shape. We're launching in 10 days. I'd hate to have to leave you behind. Dr. Alicon, may I say that I do appreciate your professional concern, but I assure you I'm- Forget it, Dr. Okuda. You're not going out. Atlantis, what are you guys doing? It's the third one already. They'll figure. So do we pull her up and change it now? We were just about to head back in. Nah, come on in. We'll take care of it in the morning. Copy that. We're on our way. Whoa, Rick. Let's think about this. If we wait, we're losing at least six hours, and we only have three saws left for drilling. Those extra hours could make the difference. Nah, uh, we're all too tired, Hiromi. Rick, three saws, that's it. We need every minute of drilling we can get. Radisson Atlantis, change of plan. Stay put and pull her up. We're on our way to help. You now go, we'll let Mikhail sleep. Let me go with you, Rick. No way he's going, Rick. The EVA rules are clear and I will not clear him. If you really apply the rules, you wouldn't permit any of us to go out anymore. Your arm is at 80%, Hiromi, and the rules specifically state The break you... is healed, and I'm not exhausted like everyone else. So we're probably even. Rick, I've worked my entire life for this. All right, Hiromi, let her rip. There she 
goes. How do you cross your fingers in these things? You don't. You do it back at the hab. Okay, let's go. We've been out here long enough. Don't you think we should stay, Rick? Just in case. Oh, forget it, Jerome. You already got me in enough trouble today. But we're this close. I'll to... tell you what. If it hits this time, you can come back. All right? Good for you, Rick. Hey, look at that. It's water. Isn't it beautiful? It's sublimated. Atlantis drill site. We pit water. Oh my god. We did it. We did it, guys. It's snowing on Mars. Just like stars. Mikhail! Mikhail! We hit water! The cable's jammed. Okay, I'll get the tools. Are you serious? Shut it down, Jackie. Copy that. Everybody back off. We're starting to really light out here. Secure the samples. Everyone back away. Can't see a thing. I don't like this. Atlantis the drill team, what is your status? Hiromi, Jackie, Antoine, respond. Lucia to Rick, do you copy? Rick, do you copy? Mr. Okuda, Mrs. Okuda, Hiromi told me about this stone he carried here from the summit of Mount Fuji, Japan's Olympus. And he told me a proverb. He who climbs Mount Fuji is a wise man, but he who climbs it twice is a fool. But your son also said that he would climb Mount Fuji again so he could return this stone so that the two great homes of the gods could be joined as one. Hiromi didn't think that was foolish. Neither do I. Three, two, one, ignition. Jackie and Mikhail are checking environmental, trying to determine the source of this mold. So all I need you to do is concentrate on the bypass. <coughs> so how long before we can fire up here? Before we can try, you mean? Yeah. I don't know yet. All right, well, let me know when you do. Lucia and I are gonna finish unloading. This should not have happened. Yeah, a lot of things shouldn't have. Confirm docking collar release. 
Blocking color release confirmed. <coughs> Stand by for auto set. Clean set. Mars has a new satellite. We missed some. And there's some more over there. Once we're up to speed, we'll have to do a full inspection. Right now, our priority is the TEI burn. If they don't fire, we have enough supplies to remain in orbit for two years. Well, think of it as incentive. Take us home, Antoine. Three, two, to applaud. 27 minutes, 48 seconds remain in this bell. Status report, February 28th, 2031. Terra Nova has been scrubbed from top to bottom and is now free from all visible contamination. We're still suffering from persistent uh, respiratory irritation, sinus pain, headaches, which is consistent with our exposure to all the mold and possibly dust from Mars. After initial tests, I can determine no other cause for these symptoms. Flight surgeon Lucia Alarcón, out. Every test again. Oxygen levels, water quality, checked for trace pollutants. Everything is nominal. Well, obviously we're missing something. Hmm. Maybe it's time to consider the other possibility. Mm. Something from Mars? Is that what you mean? <laughs> is there anyone who hasn't already thought about it? Okay, Let, let's say, for the sake of argument, that it is a possibility. What are our options? Not many. If it's something that all of Lucia's tests cannot even recognize. Well, there is one thing. But I'd need your permission to break one of the seals and test a sample. You know that we can't do that. If we can identify a contaminant from one of those samples, there's a possibility that someone on the ground could find an antidote. I'm sorry, it's out of the question. We're all well aware of the protocols. Everything from below the surface of Mars can only be opened in a receiving lab. <coughs> if we open a seal, even one, then everything in this vehicle, including us, become presumed biohazards. And if not, we'll be presumed dead. I'm willing 
to consider the possibility.